Okay, so hello everyone. Okay, so some people have been requesting that I make um, Magar versions for the derivatives of the ARC units. However, um, I'm having a hard time finding in-game textures for that and besides, uh, as you can see here, another hyver by the name of Freaky have already made awesome uh, Magar skins for the several of the in-game ARC units. So as you can see here, he has an entire set and he even has the appropriate icons. So let's go for one of them. So as you can see here, this one is for the grunt. Although however, this is under textures. So if you were to uh, follow the instructions here after you um, imported the texture, via the world editor and then follow this pass what basic what it basically does is it's going to replace the green skin grunt now some people have uh, told me that they wanted to use the uh, magar texture so that they be able to have a magar grunt alongside the green and uh, fell art grunts in game already so basically um, you are just going to need to do additional steps so first things first, you download Freaky Skin here. So download. Now, you can name the texture whatever you want. So for, in my case, I've named the texture Magar Grant Freaky. And then again, uh, using the Magus model editor, uh, links below, open the Warcraft 3 MPQ and then under units arc and then grunt so basically this is the model for the green grunt so what you're going to do is you're going to export it yeah you can name it what you want for example magar grunt dot mdx and then you should also export the portrait model so this is the portrait model export it make sure it has the same uh, similar name as the in-game model up until the underscore so for example I'm also going to add model there and then dot mdx okay so let's open the Magar Grant. Now under texture, click import and then import the uh, custom texture. So whatever you named it, import it. Now what you're going to do is you're going to change the material. So uh, you can press, uh, hold down control and then left click. So that's the team colored portion. Then after doing so, for example, so what you're going to do is hold down the control button and then using the left click, you can identify which materials should be changed. So for example, in this part, this is the team colored portion and this is the material for that team colored portion. So open it. Then this is the original skin. What you're going to do is you're going to replace it with the um, custom skin by Freaky. Okay, and then now you click on the non team colored portion and then replace it as well. Okay, it's on there. Once, you, uh, once you've done uh, the edits for the in-game model you should also do so for this uh, you should do the same for the portrait model so here oops so first you need to import this skin and then again hold down the control button then left click change it okay and then save 
now you're going to have to import it for example so if you're going to import it so of course you're going to import the models and and of course don't forget to import the portrait and then finally make sure you import the texture itself now for the texture make sure you remove this portion see this one so use custom path then delete all this and then click ok and then save and then you can now create another unit for that model for, for example in the orcs we're going to copy unit and then make a new unit based on that so this one uh, let's uh, let's name it mugger and then under art model file look for the mugger grant here so it's under custom oh here okay so now you have the mugger grant alongside the original green grant and the file art grant so now let's test it in game what you want master master okay so as you can see here uh, this is the mugger grant the original green uh, grant and the fell art grant what you want zug zug master swobu what you want dabu so basically you can do the same for the other um, orcish units and the other custom textures of freaky so i guess that's it for now